First at noon, we are tracking breaking news out of Cranston right now. A situation at the ACI complex. Moments ago, we learned there was an altercation involving two inmates. We want to go live to Eyewitness News reporter Brandon Truitt with the breaking details. Well, Brian, we know one of those two people involved in this were taken to the hospital with what appeared to be a stab wound. I want to take you into this. Just about five minutes ago, we saw uh, this area being cleared, but officers were blocking these entrances and essentially creating a perimeter around uh, this part of the ACI here along Pontiac Avenue. I want to take you to the video now. You can see authorities have the entrances to the ACI blocked off. Again, clearing this just about five to ten minutes ago. These guys were not letting anyone in or out. Uh, you were able to see officers with their guns out. These officers were spread out around the complex. Our camera spotted canine units working their way around the property. The Department of Corrections tells us the victim was conscious, alert, and responsive when he was taken to the hospital. The other inmate is being questioned as we speak. And although the officers are gone outside, at last check, the ACI was still on lockdown. Back out here live, the immediate impacts of this are not being felt necessarily outside. Both lanes of Pontiac Avenue stayed open throughout this entire thing. There are questions, though, remaining at this time, and we are working with officials to try to get some more information as to what might have started this. Be sure to stay with stay with us at WPRI.com and the WPRI 12 News app. That's the latest here live in Cranston. Brandon Truitt, Eyewitness News.